So you want some help paying for college, but you're wondering where to start. To see what kind of help you can receive, you'll need to fill out the FAFSA. First, let's talk about what the FAFSA is. The FAFSA, or the Free Application for Federal Student Aid, is a form required by all colleges and universities for students to apply for financial aid. The application helps to determine your eligibility for federal financial aid, like grants, loans, and work-study. Many colleges also use it to determine your eligibility for the financial aid they provide, as well as what your state offers. Students who are interested in receiving financial aid for college or technical school, and who are eligible to file the FAFSA based on their citizenship status, must complete the FAFSA. For more information on how citizenship status affects eligibility for the FAFSA and federal financial aid, go to studentaid.gov. Now that we know what the FAFSA is and why we need it, let's talk about some essential things to consider before you begin. As explained in the name, the FAFSA is a free application. You should never have to pay to submit it or to get help filling it out. Make sure you use the correct URL when navigating to the application page. The 2024-2025 FAFSA opens in December 2023. In future years, the FAFSA will go back to opening on October 1st. Once the FAFSA is open, it is best to submit your application as early as possible since some financial aid is distributed on a first-come, first-served basis. Deadlines vary based on the state you live in and colleges themselves, so make sure to check with each college financial aid office for their priority deadlines. Many students question if they should even bother submitting a FAFSA because they aren't sure if they will qualify for financial aid. The only way to know if you qualify for most types of financial aid is to submit the FAFSA, so we strongly encourage anyone who is planning to attend a college or technical school to submit the FAFSA. You might still be wondering, is submitting the FAFSA one time all I have to do to receive financial aid? While the FAFSA is a critical step toward getting financial aid, it is only one part of the financial aid process. Once you submit your FAFSA, you will need to take additional steps like reviewing your application for errors, sending additional requested documents to colleges, and reviewing your financial aid offers. Remember, you have to submit a FAFSA every year to receive financial aid. That means if you plan on attending a four-year college, you will need to submit a FAFSA every year for four years or until you graduate. Now that you know why the FAFSA is important, check out our other videos to get started on filling out your application.